We've created a new audio-based user interface, which relies on natural language as the input, and what we call auditory space as the output. And we're hoping that these innovations will help us. And then I got this one. For you. So imagine that you're sitting in a noisy restaurant, and you're having trouble hearing your friends across the table. Hey, uh, can you enhance the sounds that are right in front of me? <laughs> and uh, can you turn that baby down? <laughs> That's better. And you know, I'm still having a little trouble hearing Pedro. Can you isolate Pedro for me? Y después manejamos. That's perfect. And, uh, you know, my Spanish is a little rusty. Can I hear Pedro, but in English? And at the end of the trip, we came back to uh, the city to visit the historic center. Where they shall all close all programs. Are, uh, That's crazy. I can't wait to get back here. And um, these glasses, they have the same feature-ish. I can have these glasses on, and if you have the app, it'll translate in real time. And so the say you spoke Spanish, I would hear it through this device that does bone conduction, and I would hear it in English. And then when I would speak in English, on your end, if you had glasses or the app, it would translate in real time, and then you would hear it. 